Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So I know it has been over a month, I believe, since I last uploaded a video. And as some of you know that follow me on Facebook or Instagram, my dad, he passed away on the 16th of April. So, um... You know, we were just going back and forth to the hospital every day. And, um, yeah, I mean, it hurts so much to talk about it. And I feel bad for, you know, neglecting to post a video and everything. But just with everything going on, I just didn't have time. And I, right now, we are just all focused on being there for my mom especially because she's you know I don't know what it's like you know losing someone your husband someone you were with for a long time and you know you woke up to that person every day you went to sleep with that person every day you were with that person almost your whole life and they had just celebrated their um, 25th anniversary and um, you know it's it's sad cuz like I tell my mom I like I think about it and I still can't believe that my dad is gone like it's so hard to believe because I feel like he's still here and I feel like he never left but once you think about it and you you realize that you know that person really is gone and um I don't want to start crying but yeah I just you know I wanted to just go ahead and start making videos again just to kind of you know distract myself besides my babies distracting me and um, you know just do something because it was just I'm not gonna say it was getting to me but it was just something I would think about a lot that would make me cry all the time and um, yeah so um, anyways guys today I'm gonna do my March and April favorites since I wasn't able to do that and I'm gonna do them together I didn't really have much products for like for one month so anyways um, let's just get right into the video I'm gonna start with the face products like um, face washes and stuff like that I recently saw that elf came out with kind of like a a skin care collection I don't know how you would say it but um, it's pretty much this is how this one looks and it's the elf daily face cleanser and it says here that it helps remove everyday impurities dirt and makeup infused with purified water to help hydrate the skin and I was using this for like about a month already and it really is good um, my face feels really soft after I use it and um, I was thinking I was like well elf is not like this high-end line or anything but I was like well I mean this was honestly the first cosmetics line I used when I first started doing makeup I got so many elf stuff lipsticks everything you could think of and I was like, well, I'm going to give it a try. So I got this, and I really like that. And I also got this hydrating serum, and it looks like this. And this, pretty much you apply it after using the face cleanser. And this says, helps lock in moisture to reduce the look of fine lines for glowing, healthy-looking skin. Infused with purified water and jojoba I don't know what, how you pronounce that but let me see if you can see that but yeah and this when I wash my face like in the morning or during the day with this I applied this serum and it really does give my face this nice little like like moisture and I you have to let that absorb all the way and before applying your makeup 
so that's what i've been using also and the last thing i got from that collection was the elf nourishing night cream and that looks like this let me make sure you can see it good and um this is pretty much just like a cream it comes with like a little thing that you just take off and you really don't need a lot but i really like this one in the night like it just it, my skin feels so soft after i have this and um yeah i've really been loving that i've been using that for like a month already and i wanted to put on my favorites because i've really been loving it and it's been like a routine already using this which i know it's not good to get used to one item only or one routine with the same products but because I've been really liking it, I'm going to keep using it. And I also wanted to include my Neutrogena Makeup Remover Cleansing Towelette. And I'm sure every person who uses these, they are so amazing. And moving on to makeup, I have a few products, not too much. But one would be the L'Oreal Infallible Pro Spray and Set. And I know I've mentioned these in my prior videos favorites because I just love it it's really good and I think it's like $20 and um, but it's so worth it and this is oil free which me is perfect for me because I have very oily skin and especially now that it's so hot outside it's oh my god Florida Seriously, it has some horrible hot weather, humid. It's so nasty. Like right now, it's raining so much outside. And um, that's why it looks kind of dark. But, um, but yeah. And this just really hydrates my skin, but it doesn't make it oily. So, yeah, you just, you know, when you need that little hydrate on your skin. And it sets really fast. So I really love that. And that's actually like my second bottle already. And another product that I've also mentioned in my favorites. And I'm still going to mention in this one. Because it is still my favorite. And it is the Airspun Loose Face Powder. Looks like this. And I just really love this powder. I do want to try different ones. Just so I can get out of using that. But I mean it's affordable and it's really good. But um, I've heard a lot of things for I think like years now. About the Laura Mercier one. And there's this other one. But I really want to try that one. So we'll see. And the next product is going to be the Tartlet and Bloom palette from Tarte. And it looks like this excuse my nails guys i'm like seriously i'm trying to take them off already if you guys know how to take or remove gel nails please let me know because i seriously like broke my nail my real nail trying to take the fake one off so and i'm just trying to dig like you know on the edge to take it off but it hurts so anyways this is pretty much the palette it is so beautiful like this palette when I saw it I'm like this is perfect like I really love this one there was this other one which it was the one that's like purple I forgot what it's called but uh, this one just really got my attention they are so beautiful and I'm gonna tell you guys a little secret of mine the color funny girl which is this one right here I don't know if you can see it's this really beautiful shimmery color i've actually been using that as a highlight and let me show you i don't think i have any no i don't have any there but let me show you it's a beautiful highlight that it gives i don't know if you can see it but just dab like a little bit <laughs> look at that a very bright highlight and i really like that and i also i don't really want to apply that to my cheekbones or anything because it's really like glittery but i feel like it's so perfect on your nose cupid's bow and your chin 
it just gives you that really nice highlight. So that's a little trick of mine. My highlight that I always use is the Mary Luminizer. And it's also been on my other favorites video. But if it's still my favorite, I'm going to include it. And another product is the Anastasia Beverly Hills Dip Brow in Dark Brown. It looks like this. And I really want to try the pencils that come with like, um, I think they have the spoolie at the end, I'm not sure. But I really want to try those too because I've been hearing that those are really good. And then I'm going to show you guys some liquid matte lipsticks that I have been using lately. <sighs> okay, so one, these two are by ColourPop and this is the Ultra Matte Lipstick in Beeper which is the one I have on now. I really love this one. And then... What? What? What did you do? Okay, so anyways, um, yeah, one of them was Beeper, which I really love that one. And the next color is called Tool. Looks like this. It's a really pretty, like, it kind of looks like a burgundy lip color. I don't know, but it's really nice. Okay, let me do, like, a little swatch for you. It kind of has, like, this burgundy kind of finish to it. And then when it dries matte, it's so beautiful. I really love it. And then I'm going to show you Beeper, too. I think I had already done kind of, like, a yeah. review on these. And I'll link the video down below. But the top one is Beeper and the bottom one is Tool. And I really love these colors. Okay. And I recently, finally, finally, guys, after months of looking for these, I finally found them. And it's the Milani Amore Matte Lip Cream. And I have... I got like three of them. One was like a hot pink color and I really didn't like it. That was, I don't know, it's just not me. So I got, I'm not gonna include that one in there cause it's not a favorite. So this color is called Craze, which is this really bright, like corally color. And I really like it. Like, I'm not gonna lie, I really like it, but I just, I haven't found a makeup look that I feel comfortable wearing it with. And let me show you guys a swatch. It's very bright. Like, wow. What is it? So yeah, it's a very bright coral color. It's so nice. I have yet to try and look with it, so. And then the next one that I got is called Covet, which is a very brown color and this kind of reminds me of limbo by color pop so um and i kind of tried both of them together and they are very similar so if you guys want to try this one instead of getting the limbo or if you want to get limbo instead of this one totally up to you but i very i see them very very similar so that could be a dupe so this is how it looks it's this one right here. It's a very pretty, pretty brown color. Okay, this one is by NYX. It's a soft matte lip cream in Ibiza. I think that's how you say it. I don't know if you guys can see what it looks like. It looks, it's like a very pretty coral pinkish color. It has more of like a pink tone to it though. And it's this color right here. And then the last lip color I have is by The Balm. And it's called Meet Matte Hues Long Lasting Liquid Lipstick. And this is in the color Charming. And guys, let me just tell you, this color is amazing. I love it. And when I say love it, I love it. But let me show you guys. And it's this one right here. I don't know why, but on it looks on your lips, it looks so much better 
than right here but it is just oh my god okay um so i have two more products and one is the kat von d shade light palette and it is just the contour palette i really love this one i really go in on this color right here so yeah i really go in on that middle color and that color is called shadow play and when i want to do like a very nice bronzy look i will go in with subconscious and shadow play so i mix both of them together which is this one and this one okay and the last product that i have been so obsessed with is the milani conceal and perfect two-in-one foundation and concealer it looks like this and i know a lot of you have been hearing about this um foundation and let me just tell you that it is so worth it i feel like it's definitely buildable but me with one coat of foundation with one application i mean it's perfect for me and it's actually what i have on now this color my no, the one i use is the number three in light beige it says here that it's medium to full coverage which i agree with lightweight oil free formula like the number one thing i look for because like i said i have oily skin so i was like yes long wearing water resistant and sweat proof okay the long wearing part i agree with i when i wear this it usually stays on the whole time i have my makeup on which is a little more than eight or nine hours sometimes um i agree with that water resistant as far as going into a pool i'm not so sure I haven't tried it um and sweat proof sweat proof uh, i don't remember having any problems with that part of it either so so yeah guys um <laughs> all right guys so um that is pretty much it for my favorites i know it wasn't really much i mean to me it wasn't much but um i really just wanted to make a video and not let it go too long without me uploading one can you turn the fan off thank you so yeah but anyways guys i'm gonna try and you know upload more videos as much as i can now i love doing videos beauty videos makeup videos i just you know it's something that i love to do and if i could share it with you guys it just it makes it really special for me to you know just show you guys things and because me personally i love watching makeup videos and everything so but yeah, guys, um, I'm going to let you guys go. I'm going to go put my little baby to sleep. And um, yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. She is such a little fanny. Wait, you are such a little fanny. All right, bye guys.